Well, we're hearing from Air Transat for the first time tonight about that six-hour delay in the tarmac that forced passengers to call 911. The airline says the delay was beyond their control. Also tonight, the Canadian Transportation Agency plans a public hearing to learn more about the incident. CTV's Katie Griffin starts us off tonight. Katie. Well, Michael, in six pages, Air Transat explained its side of the story, saying the airline tried to get permission to refuel but was denied, and that deplaning was impossible with no ground support. The Brussels to Montreal Air Transat flight was one of 20 flights diverted to Ottawa because of bad weather. Air Transat blames tarmac congestion and the Ottawa airport, saying their requests were denied. Air Transat's response contains 19 points of clarification. It lays blame on the local airport authority. It cites clogged gates and plane traffic on the tarmac, saying at all relevant times it remained impossible to safely deplane passengers. One of the passengers on that plane was Laura Ma of Ottawa. Here's what she's saying tonight. I think this is like the step in the right direction to maybe get some changes made. Uh, whether they're airline changes or how airports handle these kind of situations, something needs to change because us just being stranded for six hours because no one wants to take ownership of it is also not a great solution. And advocates for airline passengers say there is still not a proper explanation for the delay. What I'm seeing here is Air Transit simply failed to make any effort to allow passengers to disembark. There is nothing in those 19 points that you mentioned to say, at this time, we asked the airport to provide us a gate, to provide us a bus, to provide us stairs to disembark passengers. The Ottawa airport has always said Air Transat's version of events did not line up with theirs and that the airport had buses on standby and gates available for deplaning. The Canadian Transportation Agency has now scheduled a public hearing into this. It will be held right here in Ottawa on August 30th and 31st. Anyone who wants to submit a presentation can call or email the CTA. Michael. CTV's Katie Griffin reporting live for us tonight. Thank you, Katie. You're welcome.